Hey what's up guys and welcome back to another video. Today I'm super excited to show you an amazing blender add-on called Pure Sky Pro. If you are a 3D artist, you are in for a treat. Pure Sky Pro takes your renders to new heights with its incredibly realistic sky and atmosphere simulations. I will show you how to use Pure Sky Pro and create stunning scenes with this powerful tool. If you are interested in getting Pure Sky Pro, Simply click the link in the description, it will take you straight to the product page on Blender Market, where you can read more about it and make your purchase. Once you have the add-on file, hop into Blender and go over to Edit, Preferences, navigate to the add-ons tab, click Install and select the Pure Sky Pro zip file, which is this one, then activate the add-on and you are ready to go. Close Preferences, now let's take a look at Pure Sky Pro interface and explore its key features. Press N on your keyboard and here you can see that we have a new panel right here. It's called PSP. First we're gonna take a look at Pure Sky Pro AV version and Cycles version of Pure Sky Pro deserves its own video. So just click and here you can see that it's right here. The add-on integrates seamlessly into Blender's UI, making it easy to access its functions. You can control various aspects of the sky and atmosphere, including the time of day, cloud density, sun position and more. I won't go too deep into it because it will make the video way too long. So first we have the sky management, which is basically a shortcut of all these settings right over here. And you can click on update sky, which will show you all these settings. Then we have the cameras that are currently available in your scene. Here you can see that it's red. That means the camera's clip end is not synced with the scene. So I'm gonna go ahead and click update all clip ends. All right, so we have to apply a preset. Let's say maybe this one, select it and apply. And here you can see the preset. To increase the quality of the clouds, all you have to do is go right over here under world properties and increase the start clip option to 10. 100 is better but 10 is good. Then you have the option to change the quality of the clouds. So 2 pixels means the best quality. The higher you go, the lower the quality of the clouds will be. So I'm gonna go with 16 for the preview but for the renders you should definitely choose 4 to 2 pixels. And here we have some other options available as well. So let's take a look at clouds presets. Here we have bunch of these. So you can select any of these, hit apply and you have the clouds. And another good thing is that uh, you can go right into the clouds like so. You can change the time of day. You can change the sun angle as well. If you have the sun position add-on enabled which comes with blender pre-installed you just have to enable it then we have animate basically everything is animated by default and you can change the animation from here then we have volume you have low altitude clouds you have high altitude clouds auroras which i'm gonna show you right now from the sky presets here we have auroras and you can see that it looks beautiful you can fly through them as well so lots of stuff and if you want to dig deep into pure sky pro then go over to world properties and here you will have all these different drop down menus and different categories that you can customize and create your own skies it's basically endless as with any tool mastering pure sky pro takes practice and experimentation all right so that's it for this video if you want to learn how to use Cycles version of Pure Sky Pro, then you can check the link in the description down below or you can click the eye icon at the top right corner of the video. And there you have it. Pure Sky Pro is undoubtedly a game changer for Blender artists, helping you create breathtaking renders with ease. Its ability to simulate realistic skies and atmospheres takes your projects to a whole new level. So if you are serious about achieving stunning visual results, I highly recommend you giving Pure Sky Pro a try. Let me know what you guys think about Pure Sky Pro in the comment section below. And don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more exciting Blender related content. Thanks for watching and happy blending.